Humber Industrial Cluster Plan is creating a blueprint for this region to achieve that net zero ambition. None of this would have been possible without that crucial funding from UKRI's Industrial Decarbonisation Challenge. We in the Humber are in a unique position with well-developed projects involving wind, hydrogen, alternative fuels and carbon capture, all of which will be needed to deliver the strategy within timescales targeted. The funding we've got from the UKRI's Industrial Decarbonisation Challenge Fund has allowed us to develop a really comprehensive uh, project here in the, the Humber. So we are looking not only at things like how do we model getting to net zero through greenhouse gas removal or capturing the CO2, but it also encompasses things like uh, the skills that are needed to bring this about, the supply chain opportunities that we'll see as a result, and also things like inward investment opportunities. The Humber Industrial Cluster Plan is identifying a full range of interventions to be able to achieve net zero status for the cluster by 2040. It's also prioritising near-term deliverable investments which will see quick results, enabling the cluster to achieve low carbon status by 2030. Both labs in, in the Humber realise the importance of this particular project. So we have also brought together a number of the other big players and some of the other projects under the auspices of the Humber Energy Board and this is starting to make a big headway in all the decarbonisation projects across the Humber. I'm really pleased actually that we've got such interested parties around the table and that's whether they're from the public sector or the private sector and this is where the cluster plan really is making a difference already bringing people together that potentially could be seen as competitors, but actually on this particular occasion, they're actually working together in a different way and building that trust relationship which is so valuable for the cluster plan. There are a multiplicity of ways in which we're working with businesses, with voluntary and community sector, with individuals, to help them identify ways in which they can contribute to the net zero endeavour. And there's an enormous opportunity for us to be the first industrial cluster, not just in the United Kingdom, but in the whole world, uh, to move to net zero. That will not only be good for the environment, it will also mean that we develop the capabilities, the industrial wherewithal, to sell those solutions, those technologies, um, all around the world, not only helping the planet, but also reinforcing prosperity and jobs around the Humber. It's fantastic, it's a real lighthouse project. So I've already had conversations with people in Melbourne in Australia, with people in the Netherlands, with people in Germany. We've had other conversations with California. So all around the world, people are going, how can we decarbonise our industrial clusters? And they're turning to the Humber. The world needs to move to net zero. And here in the Humber, we can show the way. We are one of the most polluting areas in the whole of the country. So if we can prove how to make it to net zero here, it means you can make it to net zero anywhere. This is our time, this is the place, and we really feel together we can collaborate to deliver the government's requirements.